The Juncker test is the most severe vibration test for bolted joints. Used to compare how different locking methods behave under transverse vibrations underneath the bolt head, while continuously measuring the clamp load. Clamp load is vital, because when lost, the bolt is unable to withstand the working load. We lubricate and assemble an unsecured bolt of size M16. We mark it to easily detect any rotation and then run a test for 20 seconds. The nut starts to loosen and the graph shows clearly how the tension drops dramatically within seconds when running the test. We then expose a plain washer. A spring washer. A check lock nut. A nylon insert nut. and a double nut. All these solutions have in common that they rely on friction to secure the bolted joint. As friction is not a reliable locking method, the bolts will need to be re-tightened at regular intervals to prevent costly downtime or, potentially, an accident. Other common solutions, such as tab washer, locking wire and adhesives, are seen as safe. However, repetitive tests show that their performance can vary significantly in maintaining clamp load. These solutions depend heavily on the operator. They often require special tooling and they are time consuming. Nord Lock is an innovative solution comprising two washers in a pair. This solution uses an effective principle, geometry. The cam inclination is greater than the pitch of the thread of the bolt. The Nordlock washers create a wedge effect underneath the bolt head. This prevents any rotation in the nut. After the initial settlements, a high and stable clamp load still remains. A second test continues to show that no unintentional rotation occurs. No retightening will be required. Since the Nord Lock wedge locking system is not dependent on friction, it is also unaffected by lubrication. Disassembly is simple. We see the top washer override the bottom washer, causing an increase in load during untightening. This is proof of the principle. To properly verify the locking effect, we also check that we have clear impression marks on the nut and on the underlying surface.